Today we're helping you guys maximize your XP gains in Ghost Recon Breakpoint because we all want those sweet skill points. Now, I didn't want to make a video where the sole basis behind these tips is by glitching your way to XP or by any sort of means of an exploit that the game may or may not have. These methods are for players who want to still play the game normally as intended while still racking up that sweet XP. So we will be utilizing the game's regular functions so that these tips can help everybody gear score on or gear score off. Now, this video was a request from user CEO of Nepo, so I do hope this video covers exactly what you were hoping for, my friend. Now let's get started. Before I get into everything else, one very crucial thing to note here first is that gear score players will have a slight edge over us non-gear score players because with gear score turned on while equipping high-level gear items, you can get additional bonuses of 5% to XP with your helmet, with your vest, your pants, boots, and gloves. So that's a total additional overall bonus to XP gain by 25% with those high High level gear score items equipped. So if you're a no HUD player looking to farm XP, it's worth giving gear score a shot to get those additional XP bonuses. But me personally, gear score is just not worth it to me. So I ignore those bonuses, even though I could very easily have them. You guys know me, I'm against Ghost Recon being this RPG hybrid that it is. So I do everything in my power to avoid playing the game in that way. But again, if you are looking to farm, it's worth putting pride aside to get those XP bonuses. All right, so now that I got that quick important note out of the way, let's Let's get started. Right off the bat, turn the game difficulty to arcade. Turn injuries off. Turn all HUD elements on and maximize your health regeneration if you are looking to farm XP fast. Now, if you aren't trying to sit down and farm points like that, you do not need to do this. Like I said, these methods are for everyone. So if you are a no HUD extreme difficulty player, then by all means, keep playing that way if you want. But it's really not advised for some of the things that we will be covering soon. But I will let you guys decide what difficulty you want to set yourself at when playing with these tips. All right, so Recon Mastery, Pistolero, and Explosives Expert. These are the three golden perks that we will be focusing on here in this video. So you're gonna wanna get those three perks selected for maximum XP gains. And I will explain now very fast how you get those three perks. In your skill tree, I assume most of you by now have most of these things unlocked already, but for the players who are sort of new here or need these specific three, you can find them in these sections. In the Recon section for Recon Mastery, in the Weapons section for Pistolero, and then we're gonna go all the way over to the Gadget section for the explosives expert perk. With the recon mastery perk you get a 50% plus XP gain when you mark enemies with your drone. With the Pistolero perk, you get a plus 50% XP gain when you kill targets with a pistol. And with the Explosives Expert perk, you have a better throw range for grenades. And the important one here is to note is that you get a 20% plus bonus in explosive damage. Also, you will wanna have the basic passive experience perk, which will give you a 20% increase to XP gain overall. So do unlock that one too. All right, so what do we do with these things now that we have these things equipped? Missions, play missions. It gives you tons of XP as well as bases and behemoths. But before you even get going on those things, bivouac first and apply the resources preparation for an additional 10% in overall XP bonus. So first thing is to find a large base, a base with a dense population of enemies as well as a behemoth. Perfect base for that would be the Howard Airfield located in Sinking Country. That's because it's full of different enemy types as well as a behemoth and they are all on the ground level. So you do not need to go through any buildings or things to find the enemies. Everyone is an eye shot on one level. Mark every enemies and watch your XP numbers explode left and right. Watch your meter fill the fuck right up. And then after that, go to town with your pistol for those maximized XP gains on all infantry. Headshots will give you even more points. Use explosives on the behemoths for maximized damage output. Thanks to that explosives mastery perk we selected. Loot what you like and then go at it again or find a different base to change things up. Another thing to note here is that CQC takedowns give you like double the XP that you would normally get from even a pistol kill with those added increases. So you can even sit there and just CQC enemies all day long and then take out the heavies with your pistol for maximum XP gain. You can even take an attack chopper and just fly around the base rocketing enemies if you want. That's another method that works too for farming fast XP. Now lastly, for all you players who did fully complete the conquest mode in Operation Motherland by capturing all the regions, you can unlock the secret mission, which when completed gives you a consumable called the Russian Ration that when you do eat it, it gives you a 40% boost in overall XP gain for a whole 120 minutes after consumption. So for you players who have beaten Operation Motherland and would like to know how to unlock that secret mission to acquire the Russian Ration for that extra 40% bonus to XP gain, just go on YouTube and search up secret mission breakpoint there are a million videos on it already and I personally have not finished the conquest mode yet myself so I can't necessarily show you properly just yet but you can go ahead and easily find that mission if you would like to do so. 
And that's really it, guys. All those elements I covered will help you maximize your XP gains in Ghost Recon Breakpoint, but it doesn't stop there. Share your tips and tricks in the comments and help out your fellow ghosts. Me personally, I never farm points, and that's why I don't have the highest rank because I just play the game and I don't really pay mind to any of that stuff mostly, but I know now with the new weapon mastery system upgrades that did get added with Motherland, I too am looking for a quick fix of XP gains because I need to make videos, guys, and having more things for me unlocked helps me cover more things in my videos. So I hope you guys do enjoy these tips. I hope you go and have fun, and as always, thanks for watching and take it easy.